Hey everybody, welcome back. So today we are going plant shopping, my all time favorite thing to do. And I'm especially excited about this video because I'm going to go plant shopping with another plant YouTuber person. I've never done that before. Like this is the first time we will have met. So I'm meeting up with Sarah from Peanuts Plants and I will be linking her information in the description below. And she hasn't been to uh, some of my favorite nurseries here in Charlotte. And uh, as you guys know, we have really great ones. So I'm really excited to share those with her. I know I definitely want to check out Cactus Club and Malone's. And if you don't know me, welcome my name is Ashley and this channel is all about like good planty houseplant stuff so if you like that kind of thing feel free to subscribe I'm also on Instagram and have a plant account on there I always love to make new plant friends so say hi all right so she should be here any minute and I am super excited to get going and, and do some plant shopping all right guys so I'm here with Sarah hey. Woo and we're right outside Cactus Club and you've never been here before no I've never been here before I'm really really excited Honestly, I'm so excited just to meet up with you and go shopping. It's been oh, on my wish list for a little while to meet up with a planty friend and go shopping. Oh, and I love that. I love that you've been in Charlotte area and we just haven't we just haven't met up. I know, I can't believe it's it. Time. Well, yeah, it's time. we finally made it happen. Yep. So we're gonna do some plant shopping. I'm excited. I'm ready. Oh my gosh, okay, so tons. Tons of good stuff. Look at that. This is huge. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see it. Look at how big those leaves are. And they're only 20. That's a good deal for that. There's a lot to look at. What is that? A bipedal folio? I have one of these that is, I got a cutting. Um, Are you so excited? I'm so excited. Already? <laughs> I can't, I know. I'm like, uh, gotta make sure I got my plastic money. 58. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. But for the size, $58. Look at how pretty. Oh no, I know. I'm so excited. I have one and Are they? they're just different. Okay, good to know. It's they're, been on my wish list forever. And I know, mine too. I got a cutting, but they take forever to root. Okay. They good. like take forever to root and the leaves are like this one's feeling like it needs a water. Okay. So when it feels like this, I feel like when, when it feels like this leaf, that's when I give it a drink. Okay. So. Yeah, I get like plant tips and everything. Yeah. I know. I have one of these too. I got this as a cutting. Now these grow fast. Oh my gosh, that's a great deal for $15. I picked up one of these um, the last time I was here and it's already grown like a bunch of Isn't new it crazy? growth. Yeah. Beautiful. Ooh. I cannot There's believe so many these. Good plants here. The sissus, that's huge leaves. That's a good deal, but they will crisp up really fast on you. Yeah, I've been having a water. I got um, a small one of these, that's like this thought. size last time I was here, and I have to water it all the time. Just put it outside. Oh, and I got one of these from here too. <laughs> this is so pretty. What is this? That's an alocasia black velvet. Yeah, and I love this. Oh, they have some bambino. You know I want to touch. I know, look at that one. Looks like they've added some more plants here. They, um, I love that they incorporate like some of their own collection. I like that. And some of it is for sale. That's like, cool. like, look how pretty this tie is. It's beautiful. So really. Mm -hmm. Oh, I've actually never seen a tie in person. Like a lot of these plants I've never even seen in person. It's exciting, isn't it? What is this? That's how I felt the first time. Vecchi, vecchi and then yeah, vecchi I heard that. maybe. Oh, big. This makes me feel better. Oh, me too. Are crispy. Me too. Like I, I have felt such the same a way. Time with crispy leaves. Yeah, I do as well. And even with a humidifier going, sometimes like, and it's just on my anthurium that it seems mm -hmm. to be. Well, that's not true. I take that back. I have a lot of plants <laughs> with crispy. Anything calathea. Crispy. Yeah, crispy. tons, tons of it. Like, look at the size of this leaf. That's huge. I cannot believe it. Oh, I shouldn't be touching. Is. Do not touch. <laughs> no, I'm in trouble. Crunch. Oh, and they have Cebu Blue. Yeah, do you have Cebu Blue? I have one tiny little cutting oh, of it. I need some cuttings. Oh my gosh, I can't believe they, they have these so here. Fast. They're yeah. awesome. I they love my little. Water on their Let me see. Like, they will just... Are they? Yeah. Okay, it's good to know. It's nice to have a plant friend. We can exchange some cuttings and that kind of thing. I know, right? Oh, blemish box, that's cute. These must be little injured babies. 
<laughs> Let's take a look at the blemish box. Uh, Maharani, maybe? And it has some new growth coming out. That's good. I can, but it's in great shape, even so. I have one of these and it's really like, it's great. Mm -hmm. So easy. I love it. Aren't the leaves so like textured? Even though I'm like, you know, stay away from allocation type stuff. I know, I can't resist. Like I have, I'm dealing with spider mites right now. And uh, I'm sorry, I just love them. I'm gonna continue to risk the spider yeah, mites and, the and deal with it. I watched a video from uh, Heart Shaped Leaves. Where she does it with the brush. Yeah. so smart. So I'm gonna do that. I think tomorrow I'm gonna treat the plants that I have it. I saw one, it was just a... Lots of good stuff. Maranta here. They have a fry deck. Do you have a fry deck? I do. It's, mine, it's mine was struggle city until I put it outside. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, I love seeing all your plants outside. I think that's wonderful. What do you think that is? Imperial red. Ooh. Cool. I don't know what that is. I think I might need one of these. <laughs> yeah, I need all of these plants. <laughs> I need all of them. Then this is what I'll do. I'll like sit here and pick out for 20 minutes which one oh. out of the five plants. Yes. Is the better, the better one. Gosh, they always have great stuff here, and it's like every time I come, even if it's just only been a couple weeks, it's always it's new. Like they have new. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are. Some of my plants. Do you see this like spotting stuff on here? Mm-hmm. I don't know what it is, but some of mine have them, and it doesn't seem to get worse. I'm not exactly sure what it is, but yeah, it doesn't seem to get any worse. And newer leaves put out necessarily don't have it, but it stays. At first, I thought it was blight. Do you know what blight is? Yeah, I I've don't never know had what blight, it is. But it's not. It's just something that sometimes they sometimes have. they do it. Yeah, and I don't know exactly. I what think it is. sometimes it can be from like. Normally, if it's all up around here, it could be from like incongruent watering or something. Yeah, like it could that. be. I don't think incongruence is the right word, but it's some sort of like not watering consistently. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that fry deck's only 24. Some Brazils. Pretty Monsteros. Sure What's going on with your Monsteros? I don't know. I basically just... <sighs> okay, so I killed two. You and, killed two Monsteros? Yeah, I killed two, and I, <laughs> oh no. I saved two cuttings from them. I don't know what happened. They were beautiful, huge. So then I got another giant one that was probably this big and it's like already just looking sad and I'm like, what is wrong with me that the easiest plant of all I can't keep alive? Oh no. For some reason I can't. Oh, that's a pretty one up there. Philodendron Dark Lord, that's what it is. Oh, that does look like it. Yeah. Mine's doing great. Is it? Yeah. Uh, it's doing really well, like a little bit of crisping, but not horrible. Yeah, mine has a ton of new growth. Like it's getting huge. I have it like under this grow light spot under a table and I think I'm gonna have to move it cause it's getting so big. I just don't know about um, winter time with them. Is, are they difficult in the winter time? I, I don't know, I just got it this year like a few months ago. So we'll see. I'm so curious because I got so many plants this year. I'm like really curious to see how they're gonna do um, in the winter time, you know? I'm just gonna have to blast humidifiers. Yeah, I have a small Do you use humidifiers? These are so pretty. Those are so pretty. These are really, really pretty. I love them. Pedatum, you said? Um, Pedatum? Uh, bipedifolium. Bipedifolium. Or horsehead, you know, horsehead philodendron. They whatever. remind me a little bit of my silver sword. They do, don't they? Yeah. I don't have a silver sword, but they're kind of really silvery looking. Yeah, they are. They're beautiful. 
some cute little cacti, little white ghost. They always have stuff here that's, yeah, they have the white ghost, a couple of those, Lactia. Look how pink that one is. Oh my gosh. It's so pink. That's crazy. I love it though. That makes me want it. Got a ton of begonias. I haven't even looked at the begonias yet. Do you like begonias? Yeah. I do too. As of now, I used to not. I was like, what's the big deal about begonias? Then I started getting some and I, now I'm Now you're hooked? Begonias. Yes. Well, they grow so well here. They grow insane here. It's amazing, and I, I see people commenting, like, begonias, you know, I can't get them to grow because they don't have humidity and stuff. And I just feel so fortunate. <laughs> this one, I don't know what this is, but this looks like something I want. Beautiful. So beautiful. I do really well with it. It has neat type, texture. This type of angel type wing begonias is what I do best with. Yeah. So any of this kind of type. I got a looking glass one from King. So do I. Yeah. It's got huge. They're beautiful, aren't they? They're like six dollars. I know too. it. It's so it's such a good deal. That's the leaves stay small. Okay. This type, they the leaves stay small and they grow really long. So yeah, smaller hmm. leaves, longer. They don't get big like these leaves will. Okay. I do have like a small one of these. Um so yeah, I just thought that it wasn't growing for the longest time. <laughs> and then I realized that, What am I doing wrong? What's going on? I just like the dark. The goth yeah. in me just loves the dark. I love it. Oh I love God. dark foliage and that one's beautiful. So pretty. You have some ficus audrey. Okay. The 14. I'm not big on this. Yeah, a lot of people love them. Oh, they have some jewel orchids down there. I didn't even notice those. They don't have a price. They were here last time. They're so beautiful. I like the ones that um, look Are like- like neon. Yes, and look like yes. they have lightning. Yes, the veins in them. Yeah. If I saw one of those, I'd have to get it. Mm -hmm. I think so too. Just because they look so cool in like a little cloche. Awesome. But the problem is, I'm like, okay, well, I'm good. There's so I'm many like, things I'm tempted to buy. Like, I'm almost tempted to buy a big pot of those. I'm yeah, gonna bring you some of those. Cool. All right. I'm gonna get more Dark Lord in soon. Yes. Oh, those are nice. So pretty. Yeah, I'm gonna get more of those. Hopefully, I'll get more Florida Ghost in. Yeah, I'm gonna get more Florida I'm tempted to get one of these. <laughs> I mean, this is just. It's beautiful. Aww. Hi, sweetheart. Oh, you're so cute. It's all right. Sweet baby. Yeah, well, she's a good girl. She deserves to be with you. It's her store. Got some beautiful out in Sunny Eye. So huge. Variegated ZZ over here. Absolutely stunning. How much is the ZZ? Uh, 200. 200, okay. It's huge. It's like the biggest I've ever seen. We have four of them. That's the last one. Wow, I bet. Of course it's raining. Cats and dogs. <laughs> it never fails. Oh, oh well. All right, so we just finished up at Cactus Club and Sarah got a bunch of plants, I got a plant. I can't wait to show you the haul at the end of this video. Now we are at Malone's, which she's never been here before, so I'm really, really excited to show her because this is one of my favorite nurseries, as you guys know. She's also doing like her intro over there, look. We're both filming. <laughs> it's awesome meeting another like planty person and, and doing this together, so. All right, let's go see what they have. I definitely brought the rain with me. Of Never course fails. Of course, you brought, of course you brought the rain. You I brought always, the rain. You always bring the rain with you. I know it. I it's know it. Right I now. know it. This is just the succulent section. Like, look at it's. I cannot. This is, this is seriously insane. Oh, yay. Best reaction ever. 
They have so many different types. I know. These are all their uh, like mother plants. Okay. And the ones hanging in the big baskets. Nice stuff. The there it is. Uh. <laughs> Two dollars each. Wow, that's a really good deal. Yeah. Two bucks and there's just like, they're everywhere. Every time I come here, I kind of have to like gloss over it because there's so much. No idea what most of this stuff is. Cool, right? Yeah, over there is like all the tropicals and stuff like that. And then they have more of their actual like cacti. Wow, look at this uh, corn cob cactus. It's huge. I'm so shocked you've never been here. It's all house plants. Look at this big Hoya. I didn't even notice that. So cute. This one's really pretty. I don't know Is that I fruit on there? I don't know if it, it looks like an orchid or a rich phallus or something. Absolutely massive. Beautiful. And they have this like silver dollar one. Is that what this is? Oh, that's cool. I've wanted one of those. Yeah. <gasps> they have Mikeans. No way. Oh my gosh, look at these. That's a nice one. Oh, I've never seen a Colosa like that. I have. Me either. Oh, I was about to say, there's no way. It's got a Wow. $10. Best deal ever. It's <laughs> sold. <laughs> We're taking it. I was like, there's no way that's $10. Yeah, that would make sense. This is, this is like where they keep their rare stuff that comes okay. in. So they have some whale fins. And I'm going to go this way. Okay. Ooh. Um, that's a 20. That's not so bad. Yeah, no. I don't know. Mine your way. <laughs> I don't know. Yes. Oh, that's really cool. I do. The best plant. So easy, doesn't need anything. I'm obsessed with it. Oh my gosh. Some Ratusa. Look! Oh my gosh. The variegated ones are 75. Oh, do you have one of those? No, I don't. I don't either. I've been eyeing them. I know. Ooh. Thinking about it. Oh, well, I guess those are the mother. I've got there, but. Beautiful. Twenty-five dollars for that? Yeah. Is that serious? Yeah, wow. That's, that's a great really deal. deal. Yeah, that have multiple. Seventy-five. Yeah, That's about right. Got some Raven Zizis. Monstera tie. Yeah. Yes. Crazy. One of my viewers commented that sh her husband came and bought her. The monstera tie from no. here, one of them. Yeah, I know. Awesome. I was like, that's a good man. That is a good man. So, are they supposed to be like light colored like that? I'm a little confused. Yeah, the new growth. The new, okay, so the the new, new growth, growth is, is like lighter. is lighter colored, and then the older it darkens. Um, and I haven't really done much to mine. It's very very easy. I was surprised. Yeah, I want that. I want that. I want that. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's so much. Holy cow. Did you see these? Do you like these kinds? Those are cool. I don't have them. They're weird. Ones. I don't know what they are. They look like, you know, um, they kind of look like nerd candy sticks or whatever. Yeah, <laughs> or little butts too. That's what someone little said. Butts. Yeah, that's cool. they, um, they're called Dragon Jade okay. and they're a type of Deshidia. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Cool. I just got one. This was one of the ones where I put a uh, carpet cleaner instead of neem oil. <laughs> <laughs> carpet cleaner. Yeah. I heard somebody put bleach on there. I'm like, you would have smelled oh. it. Like, 
All right, guys, so they do have Mikan's here for 20. Like, that's a great deal. Um, what else do we have? We have, like I said, some of these Dragon Jade for 20. Or, I'm sorry, not 20, 70. Ratusa's for 35. There is a Monstera. We were looking at the Monstera Peru for 40. There's two of them. The Thai Constellation is 350. The Ravens are 40. Now, again, this is their rare plant section, so it's going to be on the more expensive side. As you can see, they have like all their tropicals, and these are all well priced. Um, as are their rare plants. I mean, I have to say, I am a little tempted. I am a little tempted to get this one. I'm thinking about the carry eye. Are you for real? Yeah. I don't know, $70. Sorry, I think it's high. <sighs> this is a great deal for the real thing. Best deal ever. Alright, I don't need one. I, I had a pure gift with me one. Oh, how nice. She sent me one. She, I said it was on my wish list. So I do have one. Oh, what a what a sweetie. Yeah, actually oh. the exotic is my favorite. Yes, I got a big one from here. Hey, how are you, Judy? Doing well? This is my friend Sarah. She's also a plant YouTuber. As always, beautiful Talanzias or air plants. For all these years, I liked angel trumpets and, you know, bushes and shrubs, mm -hmm, and now mm -hmm. I've gotten into Hoyas, and I can't yes. get enough of Hoyas. Yes. Me too. I love Hoyas. And there's tons. Yes. That's what the problem is. Tons and tons and tons. You know, you want one of everything. Yes. 100%. <laughs> no, and some of them are $50 a cut, and they're I know, I know. It's crazy. Me too. Poppins what got me into collecting house plants. Look at how huge. I mean, they get finished nice when they get so big. Um, I didn't realize the Cebu Blues get fenestration, and I That's saw. That's crazy. I've never seen a Cebu Blues yeah. like that. Me either. It's so like wavy. Yeah, with the wave. I don't know. It's so pretty. That is really pretty. <laughs> oh, here's some large size Peru's. For 50. That's cool. So, where do you get most of your plants? Pikes. Matthews. Mm -hmm. I love that spot. They always have really cute pots here. I'm in desperate need for light pots. I have the up pot This is cute, only $10 for that little. Yeah, that is Orchid cactus. Ooh, cactus section. It's not like a huge, huge nursery, but it's full of house plants. Yeah. They have some string of hearts over here. Fifteen. I mean, I think that's pretty good. What do you think? Yeah, I think so. It's a good deal. Only have like some cuttings. Yeah, I definitely think that's a good deal. And some of them are trailing. Some of them are starting to trail. Yeah. Mine's growing so fast. Is it? Yeah, I've had to like trim it back a couple times. Oh my gosh, they have tiny little um, paper spine cactus, tephra cool. cactus. I've I don't never know what that is. Is that the one like you looked at? No. They're um, a type of tephra cactus and they're called paper spine because they just have like, their spines are papery. 
And they're so cute. This is a small one. I have two larger ones. I'm starting to get more into like cactus stuff. I'm obsessed. Yeah, I love blue cacti as well. And um, it's nice to find ones that haven't been like smudged. Yeah. Yeah. Look, they have these succulents that look like roses. Those are cool. Those will grow crazy if you put them outside. They grow like really? a lot. Aww. Yeah, they'll grow really fast. Isn't that the mantle sensation? That is. This is, is it? A, yeah. And it pikes. Like one small thing was like 50. Is that the same thing as Sayuri? I don't know. I'm not sure. But yeah, 40 Even bucks. Like, yeah, 40 bucks. I think that's a really good deal. Because they're, they're big. Yeah, they are. And they're beautiful. Say it's very the best. Have you felt these, the cardboard palms before? They have really hard leaves, yeah. These are so cute. The little spike pots. I might have to get one. I know. I, I saw 15. one before it pikes and I didn't pick it up and they didn't have any more. Uh, Lots of Sansevieria. They always have a great selection. They had variegated fiddle leaf figs for a while. What? Yes. I I and then it's like come back to life and it's going great. Oh, now. that's awesome. I've been too scared to get one. Maybe you can share your wisdom with me. I'm scared because I gotta bring them all in. Uh, <laughs> maybe I should have got this one. Oh, that's beautiful. That's me. I, I can never remember the names of things. Yeah, I can't remember the names either. So how many plants do you think you have? Probably over a hundred. Yeah, me too. I'm like somewhere around there, which it really isn't a ton when you go through and count like... All the little ones. All the little and... ones, yeah, but at least uh, for sure over a hundred. <laughs> I don't know now that my porch is... This one's really pretty too. I is this the those. W one? I'm not sure. I can't remember the name of it, um, but I got it as a cutting. It's doing so good now. It's not the Zebrina. It's so pretty too. I don't have one of these. I've passed up on I might these get so this. Times. Zebrina, I think, is the one I might have. I don't know. It, this looks a little different, maybe. I think this is the one that begins with W. War. Oh. I can't remember. I have a really big one, and they'll tell you when they need a drink. Oh, I love plants like that. They just look like this. <laughs> Start to and droop. Then they need a drink. All my plants look like that all yes. the time. Poor things. What is this one? I don't know, but I, I, I keep think staring it's like, at is it. A red cardinal? Is that what it's called? You know the dark philodendrons. I can never tell which one. All yeah. I know is that I mean, it's really pretty. Yeah. Have you felt these, the fuzzy calatheas? <gasps> what? Yeah. I've been seeing these around a lot more. 15. I saw a huge bucket of this at um, Lowe's the other day. Oh, really? I've yeah. I've never seen this. I didn't know that they were fuzzy like that. They don't look fuzzy, but then when you touch them, they definitely feel fuzzy. Mm hmm Lots and lots of great stuff. Oh, I got a side one I want to get. Yeah, that's the tough one. What are you thinking? Either a string of hearts or a whale fin. I don't need a whale fin, but they're just such a good deal. Yeah, 25. So what are, are you gonna get anything? Gosh, I'm trying to decide. I always want like the most expensive plants. I know, I know. I'm thinking either a carrie. They're really pretty. Yeah. Um, I liked that calathea you found back there. Yeah, the calathea is really pretty too. Um I think that's everything I'm interested in. They have these here as well, which are um, a local artist. Oh, that's cool. Queen City something, and they, she does the cool like face plant. That one's pretty, huh? Yeah, that is really pretty. I, I like, like that face one. one, especially with like cactus or something in there. Yeah, and they're all over. Like they're here, they're on that side. Yeah. There's some in the back. So lots of pots. I'm like, those are really cool looking. Yeah, and they're only four bucks. No, they are not. Mm-hmm. Four or five. They might be six if they're really big. 
Three for five. <laughs> you could spray these, but I like them natural. Me too, I like the color of them. I love the color of them. Whoops. I'm short enough. I look like a giant. <laughs> I'm just short, that's uh, all it is, I'm just short. We are going to show you our haul. We had quite a successful. So many good plants. So what did you think of the Charlotte Nursery? Uh, I thought they were awesome. Way better than I thought, and I don't know why I haven't driven an hour. It was probably over an hour for me, but was it's it really? definitely worth a day trip for Aww. sure. I want to do it again. <laughs> Thank you for driving all that oh, way. Oh, you're yeah, welcome. Thanks for meeting me. Yeah, so I like, had an absolute blast. All right, so let's show what you got. All right, first up on my list is this little Imperial Red, which I absolutely love. You remember the name? I everything. did. I had to ask you five times. <laughs> then I got this little string of hearts, which is adorable. I got some cuttings from a friend, but I've been wanting like a full plant, so I'm excited about that. Then I'm so excited about the Orbifolia. I've really been wanting one of these, even though I'm not a huge Calathea person. Oh, prayer plants and stuff like that scare me but i've managed to keep the few that i have alive and i'm hoping that i can do the same with this one i know winter's coming but i'm just gonna have to stick them next to my humidifier and hopefully i'll it's be able to keep it. them so i think beautiful. so it's so beautiful then i got this little baby which i think is such a good deal this is the alocasia i can't say it tell maharani, me maharani. maharani i can't get that in my head and this guy was on sale for $12 and he's putting out a new baby. So I think that was a really good deal. Then last but not least, yeah, this one's beautiful. I got this begonia. I don't know its name, but it's, it looks like a cane type or angel wing begonia. And it's got these dark leaves and I love it because the backside, you know, has the red. And I do really good with this type of begonia. I can keep these alive. And I feel like I can keep these alive through the winter too. So we'll see what happens. But I racked up today. I'm so happy. I got to see so many plants that I never get to see in person. So I'm excited about it. Now you want to show what you got? Yeah. You got some really good ones. All right. Super excited about the plants I found today. Three wishlist plants. Uh, I couldn't believe it. So this was the first one I got from Cactus Club for $29 and someone had posted that they found one. So I contacted them and I said, can you hold it for when I come film a video? And they held it for me. And it's been on my wish list forever. Philodendron Brandy, right? Yeah, Brandy. Brantianum. Brantianum. So it's just absolutely stunning. Like the leaves are so silvery and beautiful. Um, there's just hella new growth happening, which I love. And it's a great size. I couldn't believe this was Huge. only like 30 bucks. I mean. Such a great deal. Oh, I've been wanting one of these and they're just absolutely stunning. Just as beautiful in person as I've seen in photographs. This was my splurge plant today where I have been wanting one of these forever, this Hoya Carii um, variegata. And I love it. Look, it has the beautiful like heart-shaped leaves and it does have some new little growth happening here and it was 75. But this is the only place I've seen these and I've been desperately wanting one and eyeing it. So I'm super, super excited about this one. and. It's a nice size. It's really healthy looking, and I just I'm. I got new growth too, right there. In the yeah, middle. like right here. Mm -hmm, new growth coming in. I love it. I'm in love, so I'm beyond excited about this one. And then the last one that I got is another wish list plant. Couldn't believe I found it at Malone's. Well, I didn't find it. Sarah found it because <laughs> um, she's a pro, and I have been looking for one of these in forever. It's a Calathea or something i'll put the name here because i can't remember what it's called but the leaves get absolutely massive they're super velvety like a zebrina or a Friedeck, and then the back sides oh, are the back side purple yeah they have that purple color and this has all sorts of like awesome new growth coming out um i'm just gonna like continue to repot it repot it let it get bigger mm -hmm. and bigger because i really want it to get large size and like you sarah like calatheas are one of those that's you know they can have brown crisping um but i'm just going to try to give it a, a lot of humidity and give it a shot because why not when you love a plant like as much as i love this one so i'm really Such excited yeah man i'm excited about this um and it was only 15 dollars which deal. for the plant this size great deal so yeah those are the plants that i got thanks so much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed this video and shopping with us today thanks again to sarah um, subscribe to her channel i'll put all the information in the description below um, her channel is called Peanuts Plants. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Look me up on my Instagram on my plant account, and I will see you guys soon. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.